Hello, ladies and gentlemen, lads. I'm the one and only Clover, and today we are playing A Night in the Office. Is that right? A Day in the Office. My bad. We are playing A Day in the Office. A, uh, a eight, is that 8-bit? I'm not fully sure, to be honest. A pixelated horror game, which I'm really excited to play. And, uh... Uh, so I'm a bit tired, but let's just get straight into it. Examine bulletin board. Is there no noise? Oh, it's too dark to see anything. A clock, useful for checking how much time has passed. The hands aren't moving. Huh? Hi there, friend. Hey, buddy. That's just me when I'm having a swell time. My dear's apology, I must have forgotten to turn the lights on. I assure you that none of our employees work in the dark. Anyways, my name is Clockhart. I'm the CEO of this company, Chronos Inc. Since it's your first day here, I'd like I'd like for you to get settled in. Walk around and take some time to introduce yourself to your coworkers. And if you have any questions, I'll be in my office. You walk so slow. You're, that guy already reminds me of the clock from uh, Don't Hug Me, I'm Scared. Did you get yourself acquainted with the other employees? Simon is one of our long-standing members. She's of a... Simon? Simony? Simone. I don't know. She's a valuable asset to our team. I'm sure she's got plenty of stories to share, if you're interested in that sort of thing. Haha, -ha, I'm ruining your calendar. Okay, let's leave. Okay. Oh, look outside. It's a sunny day outside. I'm Simone. Simon. Simone. We'll just say Simon. Simone. Nice to meet you. I hope you enjoy your job here. Working at Kronos is an amazing opportunity. If you got any questions, feel free to ask. What's the work? We work on Monday to Thursday. Fridays are day off, so no one's around that day. On Thursday, we have a little potluck where everyone brings some food to share. Got a question? Do you think... Don't be rude. You shouldn't judge people based on their appearance. I'm heavily judging. Wait, so if I just... I don't care that's a sunny day. Huh? Nope. A diligent worker, aren't you? Everyone gets Friday off, so the office is closed. If you wish to stay in work, though, I won't stop you. I can just change the day? I was going to make a joke like, haha, I changed the day, but huh? All right. Ugh, Mondays. I really hate Mondays. Come talk to me another day, yeah? Well, since you hate Mondays so much, like every other person on Earth, Mondays aren't that bad. Y'all are just dramatic. Okay, it's choose day in it. I don't like the lack of music. Can we put some lo-fi hip-hop and beats? It's blazing hot outside. We used to have a water cooler, but we had an accident involving someone spilled the water over a bunch of equipment and short circuited all of it. 
I think something even exploded. It was actually a pretty scary moment. Malfunctioning equipment is no joke. Clark Hart was really, was really mad that day. Man, I'm really thirsty. Do you need something? How about you fetch me a water and we can talk later, yeah? This, the elevator's broken. Water, cooler. Oh, wait. It's boxing on table, though curiosity piqued you. You feel that it would be rude to open the package meant for someone else. Open the box? Yes. You open the box filled with soldering iron. Sure is hot out today. We just have a water cooler, Brian. Employees may explode and damage the office equipment. Needless to say, he is no longer with us. He. Was there another person when it was Monday? Let's see. I want to see how this is horror because I saw this in the horror section. The elevator's broken, so I got called to fix it. I'm using soldering iron and I need it. I ordered one a while ago, but it's not coming till tomorrow. Some delivery. Eh? Well, lucky for you, you give the soldering iron to the technician. You have found this, a soldering iron. I guess I won't be needing that delivery after all. It's still going to take a few days to get the elevator up and running, but it'll make it a lot easier. I guess I'll be done by Friday. Thanks for your help. Damn, that was easy. So it looks like we're going to need to mess with all of time. What happens Wednesday? It's storming outside with an immense amount of rain. Someone apparently forgot to close the windows. I love rainy days. As a kid, I used to stick my tongue out and drink as many raindrops as I could. It's not as efficient as drinking water normally, but it was a lot more fun then. Unfortunately, this rainstorm brought a power outage with it. I was working overtime, but I'm staying a little longer to enjoy the storm. Okay, so this is obviously a puzzle. Wednesdays are stormy days. Nasty storm out there, isn't it? Fortunately, we have a backup power generator. Unfortunately, there's only enough power to power this very room. Up, 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 Thursday. There's a wide variety of food within the feast. There are two empty water bottles tucked away in the corner. You take the water bottles. It's a sunny day outside. Haha, <laughs> food day. I brought sandwiches and snacks for today. Feel free to take what you want from the table. Simon always brings a lot of grub on food day. Honestly, I think she does a little too much around here. But that's not really a flaw, is it? Being too nice. Me? I'm just here for my paycheck. Okay, so we're going to go back to Wednesday. Fill these water bottles with the rain. Did you enjoy the food? It's company tradition here for everyone to contribute something to the table. That applies to more than just the food, of course. Okay, take this. Nope, nope, Wednesday. Tuesday was the hot day. Okay, well, hold on, empty, all right. You stick the water balls outside and let them fill up with rainwater. Okay. Now then, here, Tuesday. Okay. So I don't really know, like, what kind of commentary to put. You hand him one of the water bottles. Hey, you actually got it. Thanks, man. You have no idea how much I need this. I appreciate it, really. Hey, I know that I know I was kind of a jerk earlier, so I'll let you in on a little secret. It's about the company we're working for, Kronos. You know how we're supposed to be consult a consulting firm, yeah? Well, we haven't had any clients for a while now. I don't don't know how long it's been since our last one. It's hard to keep track of time sometimes. All I know is for some reason companies just stopped seeing us. And you know what's even weirder? Somehow our boss keeps finding work for us. A consulting firm without any clients should be dead in the water, but we're still getting paid. I ain't complaining, but frankly, it's starting to get to weird me out. Anyways, that's the office gossip. I'm leaving the company soon, so might as well get it out. 
Just got to send my boss my two-week notice this Friday, and then this stuff will all be behind me. If you want to know more, you can try asking Simon about it. She's been here longer than I have. Take care, man. Simon, buddy, water. Hydrate. Thanks, but uh, I don't know what to do with this. Okay, the, eleva the elevator's operational Fridays. Simon lets us ask questions Monday. Got a question. Okay, so let's do the elevator now, because we know that will work. Yes, what does this company do? Kronos Inc. is a consulting firm renowned by many companies around the world. By solving our clients' past problems, we ensure that future ones don't occur. I assure you that working here is an excellent opportunity. However, there's a lot, lots of work to do, so it's quite easy to lose track of time. So if you need to remind yourself of the date, just look at where the pin is on the calendar. Studies show that four days work week increase employee morale and productivity, so I implemented a schedule where employees get Friday off in addition to the weekend. Unfortunately, it was starting to cut into their profits, so I had to get rid of Saturday and Sunday. Pretty brilliant, right? Like, the days you removed them. October 2020. Wow, was that the date this game was made? Okay. This should be working. The elevator needs a four-digit number. Twenty twenty? No. Uh, shoot. October twenty twenty. That's ten twenty. Let's go for Tuesday. Go through here. So that I'm not talking a lot, I just don't really know what kind of commentary to put behind this. What's that? You need to know more about our clients. Truth be told, we haven't had any new ones for a while. Maybe clock hearts moving the company in a new direction. Although, hey, is it okay if we talk about this later? I don't really want to talk about it when I'm around others. If you can meet me sometime and we'll be alone, I'll tell you more. Okay, so Wednesday, because that Wednesday's the rainy day. How I, actually how I how I am already remembering that is because of that one episode of Winnie the Pooh, or that one part of Winnie the Pooh where it's oh it's Wednesday and it's all windy and stuff. I always found thunder. But you didn't come here to enjoy the storm, right? Somehow we're still working even though we have no clients. In fact, every day is just a constant stream of work. I can feel each day pass by. I know when it's a new day, but I don't remember leaving this building. Sounds crazy, right? How can I not remember my life outside of work? Anyways, I asked Clockhart about the client thing before. He would always just give me this really weird stare, then walk away. How did he? How can he stare? He's a he has a clock for a head. Whatever. So one day, Snoop runs off fish when he wasn't there, and I found this. Hands you a new super. I, I don't know what to make this, but you're a new face here. Maybe you can figure out what's going on. If you could, tell me. I would be grateful. Kronos Inc. gone on May 27th. Kronos Inc. filed for bankruptcy. Shortly after, the company 80, the company's 87 employees, including its CEO, mysteriously vanished. Their whereabouts are still unknown. Attempts to enter the building have... May 27th. 
That's five twenty seven. Okay, talk to you about this. Nope. Can I leave? It's locked. Oh? Yeah, I put it as Friday. May 27th. So, let's try... No, wait, zero, five, 27. The elevator's unlocked. Take the elevator. Yeah. Never mind. I'm going to, I'm going to go back down. In fact, I think, I think I like, I think I like Mondays more. <laughs> okay, here we go. This isn't disturbing. Looks really cool though. It's my functioning piece of equipment. It looks quite dangerous to handle. There's a dead body lying down on the ground. It's all bloody and bruised up. You check the body for its contents. You find a two weeks notice. <gasps> Mr. Clockhart, please accept this letter as my formal notice of resignation from Kronos Inc. I'm very grateful for my time here. I hope that this two-week notice is enough time to find a replacement. Thanks for, thank you for the opportunity to work here. Sincerely, I see you. Hi, Clockhart. Hey, buddy. You shouldn't have come here. I suppose you found out the fate of my company. That Kronos went bankrupt because of a foolish in because a foolish intern damaged the system. Systems that happen to hold all of our crucial files. If you think I'm going to let my company die because of some stupid intern blunder, you're sorely mistaken. And all the news that reported the bankruptcy are mistaken too. Because as long as I live, Kronos lives forever. But as for you, your time is finished. They get hydrated! Ha ha ha! No. I think I killed him. Yeah, it's a shame because one of my friends is actually going to be the one making the thumbnail for this, but this is like a really poorly done... Oh. It's a decaying body, rotten and old. There's a name tag on it. It says Simon. Exit room. A day in the office. A game by Winrar. I'm going to play that again, see what happens if the dude catches me, and I will get right back to you, to Okay, we're going to read the two weeks notice and get caught by Clockhart. Hey, buddy. Oh. oh, so it just takes me back. Well, ladies and gentlemen, lads, that is the end of A Day in the Office. If you enjoyed, please uh, leave a like. If you want to see more, uh, if you have any uh, game suggestions, leave it in the comments. And if you want to see more by me, uh, subscribe. Sorry that this isn't like the best quality video. I didn't really know what kind of commentary to do on it. But, uh, and also special thanks to Alex Demon for making the thumbnail for this against uh, his will. I'll be putting their channel in the description along with this game. Have a wonderful evening, ladies and gentlemen.